Here we're going to just use the um, EV cellophane and we're going to keep this clear um, so that we can actually see the pattern around this wonderful hand tie. So the colours are really the same combination, really give that softness around the outside. And first of all, <coughs> I'm going to take just a couple of pieces of the cellophane and I'm gently going to fold in half. So this just creates some points. So we've got two sheets made. And I'm just going to gently patch around the base of the hand tied. And what we want to have the feeling of is that the flowers are just encased by the cellophane. So I'm just looking and making sure I get all my points correct. So I've just got my points correct and I'm just going to catch off with a little bit of cellophane. And I'm just gonna put one more piece of cellophane. And again, fold so that it gives me these wonderful peaks. So you can see this beautiful cellophane just around the outside of the bouquet. And then just making sure everything sits nice around the outside. And we're going to use one of the wonderful little black bags and I'm just measuring just to make sure where I would require my hand tied to stand. So I know I just need to trim just a small amount off the stems. And we're going to take a piece of the aubergine tint to finish off the hand tied. scrunching tightly around the base. So this really complements the nice aubergine flower in the clear cellophane. And I'm just going to just catch the odd little segment just to make sure I control the cellophane perfectly in the right position. And the beauty of having a smaller bag as well is, a, is for the fact that you can actually create some nice small impulse hand ties as well to pick up and go. So we've now got wonderful hand tied really lush so you can really see that beautiful pattern around the outside and you have this fabulous little bag and a real nice pick up and go design.